Hemis National Park or Hemis High Altitude National Park is a high altitude national park in the eastern Ladakh region of the state of Jammu and Kashmir in India. Globally famous for its snow leopards, it is believed to have the highest density of them in any protected area in the world. It is the only national park in India that is north of the Himalayas, the largest notified protected area in India, largest national park, and is the second largest contiguous protected area after the Nanda Devi Biosphere Reserve and surrounding protected areas. The park is home to a number of species of endangered mammals, including the snow leopard. Hemis National Park is India's protected area inside the Palearctic Ecozone, outside the Chongthung Wildlife Sanctuary northeast of Hemis, and the proposed So Lamo Cold Desert Conservation Area in North Sikkim. The park is bounded on the north by the banks of the Indus River, and includes the catchments of Marka, Sumda and Rumbak, and parts of the Zanskar Range. History The park was founded in 1981 by protecting the Rumbak and Marka catchments, an area of about 600 square kilometers (230 square miles). It grew in 1988 to around 3,350 square kilometers (1,290 square miles) by incorporating neighboring lands. Before increasing in 1990 to 4,400 square kilometers (1,700 square miles), and is the largest national park in South Asia. Geography and ecological significance The park lies within the Karakoram West Tibetan Plateau Alpine Steppe ecoregion, and contains pine forests, alpine shrublands and meadows, and alpine tundra. Fauna <laughs> <laughs> The park is home to a viable breeding population of about 200 snow leopards, especially in the Rumbak catchment area. The prey base for the apex predator in the Central Asian highlands is primarily supported in Hemis by Argali Great Tibetan sheep, Baral Blue sheep, Shapu Ladaki Ureal, and Livestock. A small population of the Asiatic ibex is also present in Hemis. Hemis is the only refuge in India containing the Shapu, the Tibetan wolf, the Eurasian brown bear endangered in India, and the red fox are also present in Hemis. Small mammals include the Himalayan marmot, mountain weasel and the Himalayan mouse hare. Among birds of prey noted here are Himalayan and trans-Himalayan birds of prey, the golden eagle, lammergeier vulture, and Himalayan griffon vulture. The Rumbak Valley offers opportunities for birdwatching, including several Tibetan species not common in other parts of India. Birds present here include brown accenter, robin accenter, tickles leaf warbler, streaked rosefinch, black winged snowfinch, chukar, blith swift, red billed cho, Himalayan snowcock, and the fire fronted sarin. Sixteen mammal species and 73 bird species have been recorded in the park so far. Topic. Flora This region is in the rain shadow of the Himalayas, and does not receive much precipitation. Hence, dry forests of juniper, populous, salix forests, subalpine dry birch, fir are present at lower altitudes. Alpine and steppe trees are predominantly found here. These trees and shrubs are spread across the valley bottoms. Since the upper mountain slopes are moist, this area is characterized by alpine vegetation including anemone, gentiana, thalctrone, loidea, veronica, delphinum, carex and cobrasia. The other parts of the park support steppe vegetation which is dominated by caragana, artemisia, stachys, and ephedra, present along the lower river courses. A study conducted by C. P. Kala reports 15 rare and endangered medicinal plants growing in the park, which include Acantholomon lycopodiodes, Arnebia euchroma, Artemisia maritima, Bergenia strachei, Ephedra gerardiana, Ferula jaishkina, and Hyacimus niger. Topic environmental issues Over 1,600 people live inside the park boundaries, mostly pastoralists raising poultry, goats, and sheep. This results in considerable animal-human conflict within the region. Snow leopards prey on livestock, sometimes killing several animals from a single flock in one hunt. This has been attributed to the overgrazing of livestock. Crop damage caused by barrel has also been seen. 
The Department of Wildlife Protection, Government of Jammu and Kashmir is the custodian of the park. Any activity in the park is prohibited unless special permission is obtained from the Chief Wildlife Warden J and K. The department has initiated many projects for biodiversity conservation and rural livelihood improvement in Ladakh, including the Hemis National Park, such as, Project Snow Leopard for conserving the entire Himalayan biosphere. The project was initiated by the department in 2004 and was formally launched on 20 February 2009. Ladakh Eco Tourism Project Ladakh Homestays, a program for providing tourists with access to homestays in local villagers' residences, source of additional income. Nature guide training for the educated unemployed youth. Eco Cafe for the women help group to run the cafe and sell the local handicraft products to the tourist. Creation of a no grazing zone for domestic livestock. Predator proofing livestock pens in the area. Topic. Tourism No metalled or motorable roads traverse the park. The park offers a number of routes for trekking from mid-June to mid-October. The best season for spotting snow leopards, is, however, in late winter. The historic Hemis Monastery is home to the Hemis Festival every summer. Lodging is restricted to backcountry camps, villager homestays and accommodation at the monasteries. Nearest airport, Lay Kushok Bakula Rimpashi Airport, Lay District about 5 km miles away Nearest railhead, Kalka, Haryana Nearest highway, Lay Manali Highway, and National Highway 1D Srinagar, Kargil, Lay, both near the northern borders of the park Nearest town, there are quite a few villages, and Gumphis monasteries inside the national park Nearest city, the city of Leh is 10 km miles to the north of the park. Gandala Gandala also called the Kandala, 34 degrees 2 minutes 29.62 seconds north 77 degrees 21 minutes 45.42 seconds east is a high mountain pass located at around 4,980 meters above sea level in Ladakh, 23 kilometers 14 miles southwest of Leh, in the Himalayas in India. It lies within the Hemis National Park, and connects the Marka Valley villages to Leh, and is regularly used by local people. The Summer Pass is open from June, and the Winter Pass half kilometer northwest of Summer Pass is open from late April. The Marka Valley Trek crosses the pass on the section between Rumbak and Skiu villages, which is usually done over two days. The other pass on the trek is the Gongmarula <laughs> Kongmarula. Gallery Hemis N.P. In culture The park houses numerous Tibetan gompas and holy chortons within its boundaries. These include the famous 400-year-old Hemis Monastery. Hemis was a destination and via point on the silk routes of Tibet. Over 1,600 people live inside the park presently, with a large number of tourists and pilgrims visiting during the Hemis Sechu festival. The 400-year-old Hemis Monastery has long been a place of pilgrimage for Tibetan Buddhists. However, in the late 19th and early 20th century, the monastery attracted some attention due to the writings of Nicholas Notovich, a Russian aristocrat and journalist, who claimed that Jesus had spent the missing years of his life in Tibet and Ladakh, specifically in Hemis, see Lost Years of Jesus. The National Park, Monastery and the Chongdung Wildlife Sanctuary were prominently featured in the award-winning documentary Riding Solo to the Top of the World. See also Karakoram Wildlife Sanctuary Chongdung Cold Desert Wildlife Sanctuary <laughs>